what is on your mind. Yes, let us go. The Imperators think we need their laws. Hmm. Right. So that means that uh, Riften is probably Stormcloak controlled, yes? We are going to go this way. Because there is a fort down there and I don't want to deal with it. I don't think you do either. Excuse me, dear. Two cats coming through. <sighs> one and a half cats coming through. This one is very tired. Still very tired. That chair's not very good to sleep in. But here we are. Blech. The rift is very warm compared to the rest of Skyrim. Once you get used to the rest of it, it's kind of uh, muggy and gross. This one is not entirely sure how anywhere in Skyrim can be muggy and gross because she has been to elsewhere. The south places in elsewhere where there are big rainforests and whatnot. Here you go. You are There he is. You need to keep up my friend. I know I am fast, but seriously. If you are going to head off the road to take a piss, please warn me. Or be quick about it, either one. This one does not care. Ah, and there are the... Big watchtowers. I'm not entirely sure how effective watchtowers are in the rift with all the trees and whatnot. Like, good luck seeing anything farther down the road than, you know, a couple of paces. Eh, whatever. We're back! <coughs> oh. Do you need some water? The rift smells arboreal. I love it. <laughs> it smells like trees. Okay, let us get back to it. All right. Just making sure you're all, you're okay, because this one is uh fine. It's just fine. Hello. Every time I see a garden rift, and I wonder. If it is one of Brynjolf's or if it's one of the Arls. Uh -huh. I cannot say that word with my accent. Uh, okay. Where am I going? Okay, I need to... That old woman who runs the orphanage has been murdered. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. You don't mind. Okay. In I go. Do you mind coming down here with me? Or do you want to uh, stay out here? Don't, uh, don't worry about it. Get, get your head down, otherwise it's going to get stuck. It will clip your ears and that will be bad. What is on your mind? Okay, I need you to wait here. Guard the exit. Whistle if you need me, okay? I'm not sure if you'll be able to hear me down there, but... I will. I suppose. Okay. Uh, I should probably be in uniform for this. Probably. There we go. Uh, and let me do that. 
Do not want to be grumbling all over Perinjolf, no? He. This armor is actually clean. Because I do not wear it and kill people. Or... I should say I do not wear it and go... Bushwhacking. Yes. Word on the street is Golden Glow's been hit. Good job, lass. Yes, and this is what Zetas took from the safe. Thank you, by the way. Let me take a look at what you found. Arangar sold Golden Glow? What's that idiot thinking? I don't know. He has no idea the extent of Maven's fury when she's been cut out of a deal. But I'm certain he'll find out. Oh. If only the parchment had the buyer's name instead of this odd symbol. Any idea what that might be? Mm-mm. has -mm. no idea. Do you? Blast. Well, I'll check my sources and speak to Mercer. Good plan. But for now, you're off to speak to Maven Blackbriar. She asked for you by name. She asked for Kajit by name. But, uh, Kajit thought she did the job correctly? Kajit has claws, but Maven is a very scary woman. <laughs> if it was like that, she wouldn't be asking for you. She'd be calling on the Dark Brotherhood. The... wait. It's just business. What does Maven want from the test? What is a bit... That's between you and Maven. And I prefer to keep it that way. Okay. Don't worry about it. Maven's business dealings usually involve quite a bit of gold for her people. Oh. I see. Speaking of which, speaking of gold... <laughs> of course. Your pay. <laughs> You're smart as a whiplash. I was trained Keep by the best. Keep doing right by us. And there's plenty more where that came from. Well, maybe not the best, but... Close to it. This one would consider you all to be the best, no? Alright. So, friend, you were abandoned, huh? Yeah. What of it? So, is it true bandits get, you know, real friendly with the wildlife? Oh, ha ha. <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> wanted to say something to you. Oh, this one does not want to know what you had to say to her. Thank you very much. I'm sure we'll speak I'm sure we will not. My favorite. We abetted four women on the same night. Oh, jeez. Well, if you don't want to hear it, that's your loss. If I wanted to hear a tall tale, I'd read a children's storybook. Get some better stories, ever. This one likes train very much. I would have liked to know fl no Thrain earlier. It is a shame what happened with his old clan. It happens. Hello, Delvin. So, what could I do for you today? Zaytest has completed the numbers job. Just like you asked. Unseen, too. If you don't watch it, I may actually start to respect you. Job well done. <laughs> uh, do you have anything else that you are working on right now? That Kajit could help with? I had all the fishing, numbers, and bedlam jobs. The ones with a more personal touch. Right. If break-ins are more your thing, go talk to Vex. Well, I'm going to go talk to Vex, but uh, tell us a test about bedlam jobs. What are those? Sometimes we just like to remind the city that we mean business, so we hit them hard. Just steal whatever we can until we made an impression. Oh. Simple, right? Almost. The catch is, it doesn't count if anyone sees you take it. The message needs to be clear. We work in the shadows. Steal from anywhere in the hold. And you even get to keep everything you stole. So, you in? Because she would take it. Keep this up, and you'll be rich enough to retire before you know it. Good luck. <laughs> I do not Just spend it all on me, do we? Shall be troubling you? I'll he... listen. No, uh, can Kajit sell this statue to you? She found it in Golden Glow. Thought you might like it. It is shiny. Well, well. I was looking for this little beauty. Oh. If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. There you go. This should cover it. Oh, -ho. all right. That is good. That is very good. Use your skills, not your blade, and you'll do fine. Why can't I use both? All right. So, you're Brynjolf's new protege, eh? Don't look like much to me. Well, that's just because you are tall. All right. 
Hello, Vex. Back with good news, I trust. Yes, the test has completed the uh, the sweet Didn't job. Didn't muck it up, I hear. Good. Here's your share. Excellent. And do you have anything else that you are offering? Talk to Delvin and I handle the burglary, shell, sweep, and heist jobs. Most of them involve breaking and entering. If you don't like that kind of work, talk to Delvin. He runs the more up close and personal jobs. I already talked to Delvin. Uh but there's a test about heist jobs. That no. Shill. Shill sounds fun. What is that? When a client needs us to eliminate another, we don't operate like the Dark Brotherhood. We find alternate means to get them out of the way. We send you to plant some phony evidence in the Mark's house and then tip off the town guard. The rest takes care of itself. Sound like you can handle it? As long as I'm not the one doing the tipping, consider it done. Alright, take this and get out of here. Will you? Alright. Uh, what is this? Uh, glass arrows? I think I have read that one before, and I don't really care. If I ever catch you trying to take a peek at... <laughs> I will cut off your most valuable asset, Vex. This you one likes something? Vex. Uh... Who is... Huh. I suppose I can work with your face. After all, the sculptor cannot always choose the finest clay. Oh. Uh, you must be the face sculptor that test has heard about. Yes. I once practiced my art in the salons and manners of Tamriel's great and good. Now the scum of Skyrim are my only clients. Pardon But me. no matter, the greatest artists are never recognized in their own time. So, are you here as a client? Shall I remake your face? Ah, uh, they test very much likes her face. Mm-hmm. Take out the trash like yes. I asked? Okay. Yeah, threw it in the lake like you said. Tell me you looked through the trash before you did that. What? Take it easy, Vackel. How long we known each other? <laughs> yeah, I checked it. All the stuff is in the safe. I don't need to ask. I know what kind of trash that is. This one has been in the bandit business long enough to know that. Alright. Now, did I have to talk to anybody else in here? I hope this deal goes through. Putting quite a bit of coin on the line, and the last uh, you did I have anything to talk? Through. This better be important. I'm quite busy. Uh, you have better things to do than disturb me. Never mind. You just better hope this one is another right. my coin. Right, I have to go talk to Maven. Oh dear. That is going to be fun. Okay, Nico. I have some fun things to do. Are you? Yes. Let us go. Hopefully, uh, you will be able to. Oops. Are you coming? Uh, close. Well, that's not going to work. All right. Uh, one moment, please. Um. There we go. I have an appointment with the great and good, as it were. Ultimate drive me nuts. Yes. Need something? You're a stranger here too, huh? Yeah, they don't come much stranger than me. If you got the coin, except for baby in a go. No. Pull up a seat. Anyway. Yes, my friend. Mind if I uh, ask you something? I am all ears. Yeah. Do you want to hang out here for a bit Why while I go? Not? Let me know when you are ready to move on. Yeah. This is going to be a while, I think. We'll find out. Well, it's very empty in here right now. Oh, it's you again. What in blazes do you want? A room, please? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Ah, <sighs> much obliged, Kirava. And some water, of please? Of course. Thank you very much. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Alright. You really don't, unless it's a different room. What do you want, cat? I want some peace and quiet. What is this? Oh. 
That is just the <laughs> monthly calendar thing. Hello. Yeah. What's your problem? I have no problem yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> Let me know if there's anything else you need. <clears throat> so you're the one. Hmm. You don't look so impressive. Uh, well, the test is rather short, but she's also the best at what she does. Which is be sneaky and take things. Is that confidence I hear? Or is it arrogance? Talon, Strange how often say? they're confused. You, really think the dragons you have, have to returned? understand. I it's been a long going. time since Brynjolf sent true, me anyone I can rely on. Times may be upon us. This one understands. You have no faith in the guild, though. Hold each other faith? And hope that I don't have faith well. in anyone. All I care about is cause and effect. Did the job get done, and was it done correctly? There's no gray area. Uh, you will not have that problem with the Zaytest. I hope not. This is an important job. I have a competitor called Hunning Brumidery that I want to put out of business. I also want to know how they managed to get the place up and running so quickly. And the first step is what? Head to the Bannered Mare in Whiterun and look for Malus Machius. He'll fill you in on all the details. Of course. Um, Zaytest is curious. How did you become allied with the Thieves' Guild? It seems a bit odd. But, uh... The Blackbriar family has always been allied with the Guild. Our connections with the Empire and within Skyrim make for a perfect fit. I dare say the Guild owes its survival as much to my family as it does to its own people. Uh, this one sees. Who runs the show at Hunningbrew? Some layabout named Sabion. Been a thorn in my side for the last few years now. Ah. Uh. Sabjorn seems more than just friendly competition to me. Uh, there is a story there. Not a day goes by that I don't regret letting Sabjorn get as far as he did. In only a few short years, he's taken that bile he calls mead to market and a chunk of my profits with it. I can't imagine where he found the gold to take it to market so quickly. So get rid of him and he is no longer a threat? Is that what I'm hearing? Exactly. With Sabion in prison, his meadery will be forced to close. Then I swoop in and take over the place. No more competition. Swooping. Swooping is bad. Why swoop now? Dare I ask? The Golden Glow estate job has undoubtedly interrupted the supply of honey I need to make my mead. Oh. Sabion could use this interruption to his advantage and collect a larger share of the market. I can't have that. Why not? All right. That uh, answers my question. One more time, in case I wasn't clear. You butcher this job, and you will be sorry. Oh, Kajit does not doubt that. It was good talking to you, Miss Blackbriar. Mm. <laughs>